Hey, it's Alex here again. Summer is coming to an end and for many of you who are in college, that means going back to school, which may not be as exciting as it should be. However, in today's video, I will be sharing with you a list of tech devices that will help to level up your college experience this semester to be more thrilling and comfortable. And also, if you stay tuned to the end of this video, I will be sharing with you a gem that I use to purchase tech devices at a discounted price. First on the list we have the iPad Pro, the 11 inch iPad Pro which is a powerhouse for productivity. So this stunning XDR liquid retina display is beautiful along with the powerful A15 Bionic chip paired with the Apple Pencil 2. So these combinations make it a powerhouse for productivity. So if you're somebody that likes to stop outside in between classes, take notes or even annotate over your diagrams, this is a, you know, this is a device that makes that very easy and simple. Along with the long battery life, you could charge this at the beginning of the day and still be able to use this during the day with taking notes, going to your different classes. This is a powerhouse for doing so. I'm a developer and I take notes every day of you know the different meetings that I'm on and I must say like this is one of the devices that I use every day at work whether it is like annotating over diagrams that I use or even trying to help me brainstorming this is a device that I use pretty much every day hence why I recommend this to you first. One application that I use for my note taking, my annotations, my sketches or even could be used for recording lectures is the Notability app. So this is a wonderful app that resembles something like a digital notebook with the ability to organize different subjects on this application. Next up, we have the impressive MacBook Pro, the 14 inch MacBook Pro. And this is a beast for productivity for any college students or even any professional. So you want something that will be able to handle all of the tasks that you thought it. Look no further. Look at the 14 inch or even the 16 inch MacBook Pro. So this device comes with a MagSafe charging port. So if you're in the library and you have like your laptop plugged across and somebody trips over the cable or walks and bounces over the cable, it won't fall simply because you have the MagSafe uh, charging port. Along with that, you have three USB-C uh, connections which will be able to either charge or connect any external device that you have that is needed to be connected to your computer. Along with that is a 3.5 headphone jack and a SD card reader. So if you take photos and you wanna quickly transfer your photos from your camera to your computer and upload them or do any form of editing, this device also makes it very simple. Or even an HDMI port for some of you who do presentations in your classroom and you wanna just come in and plug it into your laptop. This is is definitely a device for you. So I'm a developer and this is actually the laptop that my job gives to me to do all of my coding tasks. So if you're also in college and you need something to do your coding assignments or even just multitasking between your you know college classes, this is a laptop that will definitely will be able to handle all of the tasks that you thwarted and the battery life is amazing on this. This will probably last you for the whole day. Using it between classes, taking notes, you know, doing presentations, just doing video editing, or even just writing programs. This is a laptop that will last you for the whole day. So hence why it is also on the list. Let's talk about storage, which is an essential part of a college student life. So needing somewhere to store all of your documents or files that you have created is very important to making sure that you have a seamless and a comfortable college experience. And today I have the Samsung T7, which is the device that I use to store and even do my editing for all of my YouTube videos. So this small compact device, you're able to get it in different range, starting from I believe 500 gigabyte all the way up to four terabyte or even six to eight terabytes. 
But what I would recommend is getting something around one to two terabyte to do all of your storage. So this is a very strong and sturdy piece of SSD external storage. So done are the days when we are using the external hard drives with the spinning disk and having this fall if you're on campus kind of destroys the disk itself and corrupts all of your files that you have stored on it. So having a small compact external SSD is something that will definitely make your work experience or make your life experience as a college student a lot more relaxing and comfortable. Last but not least is a battery pack. So you're somebody that has either an iPhone or something that supports MagSafe charging and you wanna be able to give your phone, give your device that extra boost throughout the day because you're using it so hard to post or keep up with social media. So the device that I would recommend to you is the Anchor 621 magnetic battery which is 500 amps and comes around at least $39 on Amazon and this is an amazing device. I actually purchased this for my wife because her phone battery is always at 0% and I must say like every day she comes home and she uses this on the job or whenever she goes out and she says, oh wow, my battery was at like 5% and by the time I put on this uh, MagSafe charging battery pack on it, like five to 10 minutes after it's at like double the percentage that I had it on. So something that definitely delivers the power and if you don't know about Anchor, they are a excellent battery power company that makes excellent batteries. So definitely check out this battery power pack that will be able to give you that extra juice as you go through your day as a college so student. here is the gem that I use to purchase all of these tech devices at a discounted price. So if you go on Amazon under your search tab or the search bar on the left side, there's actually a section which is called the Amazon Warehouse which pretty much is devices that has been returned and sometimes to be honest with you i've gotten a lot of my devices which says they are refurbished which are actually just new devices returned or sometimes are still in the box so if you're someone that also wants to get a device at a discounted price please what I would do is first go to Amazon Warehouse and check if the device is there even before I even check the regular section of Amazon itself. So please go over to Amazon Warehouse to even look at the devices that I have listed today. And if, you, if I did not mention this, all of the devices that were mentioned in this video, the links are down below if you want to be able to find them. There you have it, the list of tech devices that you as a college student will be able to use or any professional wanting to have a high productivity through their day. If you have not, please like this video or leave a comment in the comment section if you will be purchasing any of these devices or you'll be purchasing them on behalf of a college student going back to school this semester. Hit that subscribe button and be a part of this growing family and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.